Hi, I'm Shannon Miller. We are back at TNT Gymnastics and Fitness talking all about the straddle jump. It's so important to not just have a straddle jump, but to have a great straddle jump. So I'm here again with my friend Tess. She's already sitting in straddles because I can't do that anymore. And she's going to show us not only what this passive stretching looks like, that's when you're holding the splits, you're doing your homework, you're watching TV while you get stretched out, but also what active flexibility looks like. It's so important to have both of those items. So Tess, why don't you come on with me? We're going to show a little bit of active dynamic flexibility. So this is a great exercise or drill to work every single day. This is going to help you with your flexibility and strength so you can get into that straddle jump position very quickly and effectively. And this is just a high kick. You can do kicks forward, sideward, and backward. And of course for the straddle jump sideways is going to be the most important. So that's what we're going to show today. You can do these um, just with nothing, with leg weights. I'm not a big advocate of the ankle weights, but I do like the fair band, and this is what Tess is using today. You can see she's tied one on each leg, and that's going to help her get the resistance she needs to really gain that strength in her legs so she can really pop that straddle jump at the top. So go ahead and show us a few of these. Great job. The other thing that we're working on is body position. You're always on, you're always performing, so make sure chest is up, shoulders are down and back, you're looking forward, you're top pulled up nice and tight in your core, and the only thing that's moving is your leg. You want to practice the body position that you're going to show the judges. So let's do a few more. Great job. Um, I would do maybe 15 to 20 reps, uh, forward, sideward, backward, do two or three repetitions and you'll be good to go for that day. Of course, you know, if you wanted to do a few more at home, that's pretty good too. Are you ready to get to some style jumps? Yes. Okay, great job. All right, so now we're going to work the actual straddle jump. We're going to start on a spotting block that gives us a little bit more time in the air. You can also do it on a trampoline or on a tumble track, but you really want to have that time in the air so you can work on that flexibility in the right position. You want to go for 190 degrees. Go for just a little bit more so that you're sure to hit that 180 for the judges. All right, let's see what you got. Awesome job and a stuck landing. So work that off a spotting block, work it on a trampoline or a tumble track, and then you're going to work it on the floor for the final product. Great job. Keep working that flexibility. Make sure that you are sticking the landing or getting ready for the next jump, and you're going to wow the judges. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And of course, for all things fitness, gymnastics, and women's health related, make sure to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at ShannonMiller96.